so here in this video I'm just going to add some me social media icon to my website or home page so for this I have to add some plugin for this so in order to do that we just simply have to go to this option that is plugin so this from there I have to select go to this site or reason that gets and just click on this button this option and uh, here from here just scroll down and here you see the social media button just click on the activate so now it's active right now so now we just wanted to add these button on our home page so for this we have to go to the pages then we have to select all pages and the final just right click over here edit with the elementor and open in in new tab so i want these button to be added at over here so for this i have to add one row over there so for this i will click on the add new section then i will select a row from here then in this case i have to do what we are want it i want it to be say full bit and the style or the style i will select no i don't want even i don't want video over here even don't gradients on this if i will select hover i don't type no hover i will don't want hover even don't background and i just select background <laughs> so leave it but I can choose I can choose the same image I just want it to be the black so I will do what I will do let's try it I'll select normal from here then it classic and then I will choose image I will choose this image from here once again insert media here then go to the our one section here and here in this case add padding of say 20 pixel at top and say 20 pixels at bottom it will be fine yes. and then just click on this plus button and from there scroll down to the wordpress section here and here you have to find site origin social media button this is you have to find it site origin social media button just click on this hold your left mouse button down and drag it to this area so from here you have to add the title for this so you can add anything over there just find us or you just can add something else you visit us you just can add visit us on okay then here you have to network then in the network below network you see a button that is add button just click on this add button and you will see select the network and here on the select network you just find a drop down so just click on that drop down button and here from here you have to select the network so in our case i first select the facebook and here you have to give the facebook id or facebook id of your own then simply just 
you are having the id just place that id over here otherwise you can choose hash symbol over here then icon title you can select over here you need not to specify then you can select the icon color leave it it is from here you just can select the background color so in my case i'm just selecting the background color say something like black yeah not black i'll just like to choose say gray can have number of option for selecting this so from here you just can go okay from here you can select the icon color you just can select or leave it as a white that will be sufficient then after this you just have to go to the design and layout so here you can select the button thief instead of this atom I can select it flat so I will set it once I will add all the button over to this mm, just and then Facebook is added over there So just once again add click on the add button and this time select your network type say uh, select network and I'm selecting tutor this time again you can put your tutor ID over here and icon title and here you can select the background color I think background color is looks nice in this color so I will use the same color for even Facebook or you can copy use the code from code is this so just copy this using control C and go and paste this code over here okay now to add another button I will click on this and here this time I will again click on drop down here I have to select the network and I just select say LinkedIn this time and here you can I put the ID otherwise you can use hash let this color to be same for this even okay let's close this and then go to the design and layout and here open in new tab okay if you click on any of them it will open in new tab then I will select the button theme as a flat and use hover effect okay icon size I will set to say normal and then rounding I want it to be slightly rounded okay padding padding I want a medium padding for this align over here say I will select the center align then mobile align even I will select the center and margin say is low okay
or if you don't want to add the title just remove this I don't want title over here I'll just add one more link say this time I will be selecting say LinkedIn is there Twitter is there email you just can add Instagram then the last click on the update button okay so I just want to reduce this play space over there so what I will do I will just click on the advance and uh, you know to set the margin or setting for this so here I just click on this edit section and uh, go to advance and I will reduce this padding say 0 if I will set at the top and from 0 I just want it at the bottom I will reduce its size and uh, if margin I will select over there top so if I set the 0 margin no need to set the margin even here and the layout full width default just after this click on the update button ok once updated just click on here and exit to dashboard and to see the changes on your home page just go to your home page over here and just refresh it over here so here you see services then the call to action button then blog section then we are having another call to action button then we in the last we have having our social media buttons to be displayed over there okay so that's all for now see you soon in the next video